Welcome back to the New Jersey Morning Show. I'm Mike Favetta. I'm Dina Delisa Gonzar. Dina, we have a guest this morning, a science journalist and Ooh. New Jersey author, Kira Peacock, known for her incredible thrillers that incorporate mind-blowing, high-tech, cutting-edge, science-related mm -hmm. DNA, returns to the returns with the book of 2024, Baby X. It's a thriller. It's a, among the Goodreads most anticipated books. I am very excited because I love sci-fi. And it was just nice. released this week. Kira, welcome to the show. Thank you for having me. Yes, good morning. So after that incredible introduction, <laughs> I need to know, what is Baby X about? So Baby X is about a very real medical breakthrough in development today that could potentially change the way we have babies in the future. It is quite mind blowing if you've never heard of it before, it's called IVG. And this technology, which has already been proven to work in mice, allows anyone with cells, so any person today, to have those cells turned into sperm or egg. Cells scraped from the inside of your cheek, for example, or from your saliva or mucus or blood, any cells that, that you have could potentially be turned into sperm and egg and combined with someone else's to make embryos. So this would be a fundamentally new way to have children in the future. And it would allow all of those embryos genes to be screened in advance and their traits and dispositions to potentially be scored for parents to evaluate. Wow, wow. so um, Kira, it, it, I'm sorry, is it a nonfiction book? So this is a thriller, and that's the backstory of the book is that it's all around what happens when this new medical breakthrough becomes routine and everybody has babies this way. And of course, that could allow lots of people today who can't biologically have children to become parents, including same-sex couples, people of any age, and any fertility status. But of course, there's unintended consequences, like the fact that it's so easy to swipe some small sample of someone's cells means there's a black market for celebrity DNA. And that's really the, the gist of the book. The wow. thriller part of it is when a celebrity gets stalked for their DNA, what happens? Oh, I see. Okay. So why would you choose this uh, concept, IVG? Why would you choose it for your book as a medical breakthrough? Because first of all, it's not necessarily very far off. Scientists predict that this could be plausible for humans within a decade. And I think it would have incredibly life-changing consequences for, um, for lots of people and for society at large if this was the new way forward. It's just, um, it's very high stakes and it would allow us to have more information about our future children than has ever been possible. And that's such a, a revolutionary thing that I think it's worth having some real discussion about that today and where we wanna be going as a society and also wrap it up in a package that's entertaining and fun. Um, that's my priority as a writer. Wow, I mean, this is the first I'm hearing of this type of medical advancement. So it is really just like a, a mind expanding topic. So what do you hope that readers will get the most out of this book? So as a writer, my goal is for people to be entertained and satisfied and surprised. Um, and I have been hearing from my early readers that that is the case. Mm -hmm. I also would love for people to have their mind expanded, like you said, and to consider what's coming down the pike, because while this is sci-fi today, it may not be mm. in a decade from now. So we should all be aware of what's coming next. I hear that because I feel like you saying, oh, some things that we think are sci-fi today end up to be real tomorrow. And I feel like that's true if you look at sci-fi books. And Mike, you are a sci-fi fan, you're saying, so correct me if I'm wrong, some things that were considered sci-fi years ago, you're now kind of looking at like, oh, that's what's going on now, wow. <laughs> you're absolutely right. And like you said, Kira, certain things are just right around the corner. They're not too far off to be in the realm of possibility. And that's what makes it so thrilling and exciting. Well, speaking yeah. of not too far off, you have a local event coming up this weekend? Yes, I will be doing a talk and a signing at the Barnes & Noble on 22 in Union this Saturday at 4 o'clock and would love to see you there. Kira, that sounds great. So you can go buy the book there also. Where can they buy it online? It's available wherever books are sold, Amazon, Barnes & Noble, your local bookseller. 
and your Kindle or e-reader. Kira, thank, thank you. you so much for joining us. Your book is Baby X, Kira Peekoff. Thank you so much. Dina, very, very interesting. How you can kind of take a little bit of sci-fi, uh, but you know, with with uh, the concept being almost there, like she said, ten years away. Uh, a lot of a lot of really unique things happening in the advancement of uh, in medical world. For sure. I mean, while she was explaining it to us, I'm glad you asked that question. You're like, wait, is this nonfiction or fiction? Because I was sitting here like, wait, did I miss something? Like, we, we, uh, right. how, we yeah, can do this? Something, right. So it, there's a, the, the thrilling aspect, but uh, I guess it suits both worlds, uh, whether you want to a little light read. But this one sounds very interesting. Sounds like something so. that will blow your mind on the beach if you're reading it. I think so. Yeah, <laughs> especially with the warmer weather coming up. Yes. Well, the weather forecast in just a little bit might be a good beach read. There's always more, more show online. You can watch us on demand at our website, onnj.com.